Hi guys, I wanted to pop on and do a quick tutorial on the perfect nude lip. I wear a nude lip pretty much every day because my eyes tend to be the focus. And I do a nude lip in so many different ways, probably a different way every single day. Um, I, I, I mean, I do lip liner alone, I do lip liner and lipstick, lip liner and lip gloss. I've done foundation on my lips, I've done concealer on my lips, and I find that as long as I use a red tinted yet clear gloss as the last product, it kind of brings my look together and makes it kind of foolproof. So um, I'm going to walk you guys through the steps, and I do want to say that you can substitute a pink tinted lip gloss or say like a coral tinted one or an orange tinted one. I just use red because I've kind of accumulated them and they're all over the place and ready at my disposal. Um, but, and I am going to also do my nude colors with a lip liner, a lipstick, and a, a lip gloss, and then put the red tinted lip gloss over all of that. And, I mean, it's just the easiest for making this video, but if you guys are interested, I'll show you the other ways, like how to put concealer and foundation on your lips. It actually looks really cool. It makes a different sort of nude lip. And always check out my blog because I try to write corresponding articles and I'll expand and I tend to gab a little more than I do in my videos about, can you believe that, um, about the products that I've used or products that I love, products that don't work as well. And I'm more than happy to answer questions on my blog or here, so let me know and I hope this tip really helps you guys out. So I'll see you soon. Bye guys. Okay, here we go. So I usually prep my lips by doing a scrub or brushing with a toothbrush very gently to get off dead skin cells. And then uh, you can put on a primer or you can put on um, like a line filler on your lips. Then I put on my um, lip liner and I just line my lips and fill it in. I'm using Victoria's Secret Very Sexy and Ginger Spice, which is discontinued, but I bought like five of them when they went on sale. Um, okay. And then I apply a lipstick over it and probably one of my favorite nude lipsticks is L'Oreal uh, Color Rich in Tawny. It's number 845. And again I apply this with my fingers because I don't want the color to be heavy. You can also use a lip brush. I just like finger painting. Okay, so our lips don't have too much product on them. I just go ahead and blot at this point before I'm putting on anything else. So on a tissue or a piece of paper, just tap my lips slightly. And then I put on Steel Lip Glaze in Banana, and this comes with like the clicking mechanism. So I just want a little bit. Again, I'd rather apply this with my fingers, but since the brush is here, I'll just use it. And then tap it in with my finger. And then the step that I never even forget, I mean, my lip color looks just fine now, but I always think it looks better when I put on a red tinted lip gloss. And you have, I mean, it doesn't matter what brand it is. I have a couple here. I have Victoria's Secret Beauty Rush and Cherry Bomb. I have Co Bigelow. It's like the minty one, but it's red tinted. I even have Lip Fusion, Lip Plumper, and Sexy. So it doesn't matter which one it is. I'm going to do one that's... Um, red tinted and glittery which is the Victoria's Secret and I'm applying this with my finger just a little bit you don't want to overdo it and there it is that's the finishing touch I'm looking um, at the way the camera is picking this up and it looks a little pink but it looks great as a nude lip. Like it comes together 
wonderfully. So it can guarantee that no matter what lip liner color you use and what lipstick color you use, that your nude lip isn't going to look dead or isn't going to make you look washed out. And like I said, you can use like a pink tinted clear gloss or you could do like an orange tinted clear gloss. I actually have one from L'Oreal so it makes your nude lip look like it's more of a coral rather more than of a pink or a red and um, it's great for summer. So I hope you guys like this tip. Try it out and let me know how it works and um, as always I'll see you guys soon. Bye!